Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Today we're making up this and we made a recipe previously and it was a bacon ranch. And if you like that, you're gonna love these butter pork chops. They're incredibly creamy, delicious, made in one pan. You can make them in 30 minutes. You're gonna love it, so let me walk you through this. So to kick things off here, what I've got are a couple of butterfly chops. You can use bone-in chops if you want to, but I just like the butterfly. And I flatten these out too, so they're a little bit thinner. All right, now what we're gonna do is crack in an egg, a couple of tablespoons of cornstarch, some salt, and of course my favorite, some ground black pepper. Then I'm gonna use my all-time favorite cooking utensil, my hands, just to mix this all up until the meat is well coated. All right, now what we're gonna do is add some oil to a preheated pan. And you want a fairly generous amount. Then add the meat in with my tongs. And these are tongs, guys, not thongs. Don't get them mixed up. And we're just gonna fry this until they're a golden brown. And don't be afraid to Add a little bit more oil if it gets dry. And this should take, oh, I'd say five or six minutes, something like that. After about five minutes, five or six minutes, over medium heat, our pork is beautifully golden brown, so we're just gonna set this aside on a plate. Okay, in the same pan, you don't want to play with this because you got all kinds of great flavors happening here. I'm going to add in a good knob of butter. And I'd say this is, oh, a little more than a tablespoon. And let this melt down. Followed by three cloves of garlic. And I've just chopped these up. A tablespoon of curry. Mm-mm. Just love the smell. And about half a teaspoon of chili flakes, just to give it some spice up our lives. So we'll just saute these just for a minute or two until the spices come to life. You wouldn't believe the smell of this, guys. I wish we had smell-o-vision, as I always say. Once we activated our spices, I'm gonna add in a cup and a half of heavy cream. And of course, you can use the liquid of your choice. You can use all-purpose cream, whatever you got on hand. I just like heavy cream. So we're gonna bring this to a boil. After a boil, put the pork back in. Of course, we're gonna spoon some of those ever delicious juices over the top. Mmm, this just smells incredible. After about four or five minutes, it's thickened up nicely, so I'm just gonna kill the heat and we'll plate this up. And of course, I'm gonna add in a bit of lemon juice. Now you can use the juice or a fresh lemon like I'm using, just for that acidic flavor. Of course, you want to spoon some of that ever so delicious sauce over the top. I just love this sauce. And of course, for that green effect, we're going to garnish it up with a bit of cilantro. And there you have it, guys, our quick and easy butter pork chops. Okay, so let's give this a taste test. This is beyond belief, guys. It's creamy. The pork is tender. Just incredible. There's that touch of heat to it from the chili flakes. The, uh, the curry, mm, I just love it. I could eat this all day. I'm gonna eat more. Mm. For the full scoop on this recipe, head on over to cookandshare.com. All kinds of great pork, chicken, dessert recipes there. 
You're going to love it. Thanks for subbing. Thanks for watching and see you next time.